Yo, what's up, YouTube? Axel here with some really big news. So in today's update, uh, there was a technical patch and BG released patch notes. And I think 10, maybe 20 minutes later, they released a pretty big post, which says that um, following changes are being made and they are already applied to the game. And um, some of the specific items which are found in raid, without, sorry, without found in raid status, will receive the new property. If you discard them, they'll be completely destroyed. Uh, it is said that this is intended to combat RMT and boosting, so you won't be able to drop uh, these items to your friends, and cheaters won't really be able to um, help each other, drop the items uh, to, the, to the people which are buying boosts for them, etc, etc, etc. So, how does it work? If a player tries to discard it from their inventory and ignores the warning, I'll show it to you in the game in a moment, um, if player places it in their backpack, pockets the chest rig and gets killed by another player or tries to drop any of the container back with chest rig, blah blah blah, containing this item. And if the player dies, the limited items in the NCQ container will not be destroyed. So, as far as I understood, if you do put the items into your backpack, which do not have the status found in raid, as soon as you die, those items will be destroyed and your teammate will not be able to loot it. Which doesn't really make sense to me, because... Uh, if you do have a gun which is not found in raid, and you do die with this, and you do die with this gun in your backpack, does it mean it's going to be lost and your teammate won't be able to recover it? I don't fully understand it. Anyway, so the following changes are applied to such items: money, all barter items with some permissions below, which has been shown, keys and oh man, keys and key cards, containers, aka uh, weapon cases and ammo cases and other cases which you can get in raid, I guess documents cases. Specific armbands, I think it, uh, it implies like Twitch rival armbands, um, I don't know, evasion armbands, basically the armbands which you can find in raid, probably, or the unique ones, for example, Kappa armband, we'll test it. Info items, uh, I guess it's like intel folders, uh, journals, etc. Specific melee weapons, Taiga, Red Rebel, uh, M2, uh, Tomahawk and Miller Bros. Items that can be discarded in limited quantity. 20,000 rubles, golden neck chain, um, 3 pieces, gunpowder kai, 3 pieces, tool set, 2 pieces, roller submarine gold wristwatch, 1 pieces, 1 piece, paracord, silicone tube, injectors. I think maybe this is partly to do with quests, because you do need this item for questing. Uh, for example, you need 3 gunpowders for a quest at nighttime factory where you need to place them. And let's see how it actually works in the game. So, I brought a couple of items with me um, in my backpack. So, can we drop the dock sack? Nope. If I drop it, it's gonna be destroyed. I can't drop it. Um, glasses. I can drop the glasses. Alright. I can drop the MOE hangar. Can I drop the gun? I can drop the gun. Alright, so the gun is not being destroyed. Okay. Can I drop Red Rebel? Nope, Red Rebel is getting destroyed. Yep, this is it. It's gone, chat. It's gone. Silencer, Bitcoin, destroyed. Ledex, destroyed. Moonshine. Moonshine is fine. Even though Moonshine is expensive, you can still drop it. Alright. Water filter, destroyed. M cable, destroyed. Athelmoscope, destroyed. Skull, destroyed. Paracord can drop it. Bullets. Mad, Skalex, Plint, CMS. So, injector, I dropped one, two, yes, you can't drop two injectors of the same kind. So, I can't drop the second green stem, I can only destroy it. Alright, can I drop the case? No, the case is getting destroyed. Can I drop this? Nope. Can I drop the keys? Nope. None of the keys, yep. Uh, yeah, I can't say I'm the biggest fan of the update, I really hope it does help us against cheaters in some way but i really don't find it fun because you can't really drop items to the friends you can't really trade with your friends i think uh, before bg implemented that there should have been a way to like somehow give us an option to trade with our friends in raid uh yeah i don't know what to think about this feel free to comment down below in the comment section what you think about this update because i have a feeling cheaters will find a workaround and at the end of the day i hope not it's just gonna be us, usual uh, players, which are getting wrecked by this update. But yeah, those are all the news for today. Uh, thank you so much for watching this.
give it give this video a thumbs up and uh, i'll see you in the next one